major league debut. I was, so we were still in Vegas. We were traveling back to Vegas. I think it was from Salt Lake City. We got to Vegas at around 10 a.m., 11 o'clock in the morning. And we had a game that day at seven, but one of my teammates there, Vance Worley, flew his barber in to actually get, give him a haircut. And, you know, I hopped in the chair since we didn't have anything better to do. And halfway through my haircut, Tony comes and he, he asked me, were you out for the anthem today? And I was like, no, I forgot something inside, so I missed it. He's like, well, I'm gonna find you $500. And I was like, uh, I'm not paying you, Tony. It's not happening, I'm not paying you that much money. He said, well, now you can afford it, now you're going to the big leagues. The other thing was, my parents were actually coming that day to Vegas. So I had to cancel the flight, get a new flight to go to Cincy. When they got to Cincy, we were only there for a day, so besides that, I had to book another flight for them to Philly. So, you know, it was a good day, but a little chaotic for me. I pinch ran for Flores in the top of the ninth. And Conforto hit a go-ahead home run, you know? So that was cool. I scored my first run before I got my first at-bat. 